The sport of kendo has spread across the world in the past 15 to 20 years, with championships coming to fruition only in the last 10 years. Kendo originated from the swordmanship of the Japanese feudal samurai and was developed in the last century. One Ballarat exponent will be representing Victoria next week in Canberra at the Nationals. The sport consists of many rituals which start before combat takes place, such as the placing of the headband and armour. The sword, or shinai, consists of four strips of bamboo tied together with cord and deer hide and weighs the same as a full metal sword. The armour is basically made of bamboo with leather overlay. It's based on the traditional Japanese samurai armour which they wore in the battlefield uh, a few centuries ago. And it's basically there to absorb the blows to the body, to the head and to the gloves. Before one can actually wear the armour, they must have six months of intensive training to learn skills required for the competition. 16-year-old Jason Whitty is coached by Gary and has been involved with kendo for three years. He's naturally a shy boy and kendo seems to have brought him right out of his shell. And uh, he, I won't call him a natural, but he's, he's, uh, he seems to be excelling, excelling at kendo. Last year, Jason made the quarter-finals at his first attempt in the Victorian titles at black belt level, which was quite an effort. As a consequence, he made the Victorian team for this weekend's titles. The judges look for spirit, correct technique and striking the appropriate target. So what does Gary think of Jason's chances? Uh, I think he might surprise some people because he, he's rather tenacious when he gets out there and uh, he's got a very good spirit 